Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting for towards the final episode of, excuse me, My New Boss is Goofy, so let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. Really fun, you know, at the end of last week's episode. Oh, he's talking for Keisha. Oh, it's so sweet. I'll give you a Christmas present, my love and devotion. Take off my love and my devotion. I think that's cute. <laughs> Somebody has to go as Santa. I vote Shittle. I'm just saying. <laughs> Stop buying you soon. Uh -huh. I remember I'm guessing because you've been so busy at work and everything. Don't be sorry, we're not getting angry. No, 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 no. I don't think it's up. This is the same class. <laughs> no, silly. <laughs> He's so cute. Evie. <laughs> My emo baby. No. 
Ninja Baby. Oh my god. <laughs> They really out here doing freaking fireworks even though it ain't New Year's! No, oh, wine vinegar. <laughs> yeah, come on. You do, yes. But if you want to stay with him, you tell him that. No, shut up. Mm -hmm. You would be so far away, though. Seriously, if only he had found an apartment in the same building as him, it would have been so much better. But I get it. Oh, baby, no, don't cry. Oh, no. Why? No. <laughs> I don't want that. Oh my god, I'm so cute. <laughs> oh. I know. Okay, but that that pain is like ah, uh, emo boy, right? Yo, take out the pigeon! Just be like this. They're like, just click, 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 click. <laughs> Good. 
good. Yeah. <laughs> I would love to come to your house for a party. <laughs> so... Mm-hmm. Besides, he's gonna love her regardless. <laughs> oh, it's a scar. I thought it was a scar for a moment, but it's even cuter. Oh my god! <laughs> you look so cute. Oh, it's really long. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. Hmm? Oh. <laughs> right. Oh, mm hmm See, mm hmm Here it comes. Here it comes. <laughs> that was so cute. Like a hot dog. Let's see, I, and I get it, but something tells me he secretly doesn't want it. Especially after that letter. And shit all about him. Like, seriously, once again, I really truly wish that he found an apartment in the same building. But I get it. But still. <laughs> There's not enough room for all four of you. He is literally trying to get him. I can't. Oh my god. <laughs> I can't. Mm-hmm. You do what you have to do, babe. Hey, that yellow bird is you. <laughs>
Ja. Don't cry, Jero. Yes, you wait. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I know. <laughs> you know, baby. You, you just leave it out. Oh, no. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, my God, my dog. <laughs> <laughs> My baby. And here he goes. Look at him. Oh my God. <laughs> Oh, the peach tea. Bye, you are so freaking cute. I love you so much. I am going to miss you so much. Of course, it's never goodbye. <laughs> it's not like that. Oh. Oh. Maybe it is. Just gonna be lonely without him. Mm -mm. It's gonna be lonely. Oh my god. They don't want you to leave. Yes. But just because he's moving on, it doesn't mean he's moving on without you. I'll we'll always be with you. And Umihata in this role, in any role. 
No, don't apologize. It's sweet. <laughs> As I was saying, Umihara in this role and in every other role he's done for this season, even that role, he's done it so damn beautifully. <laughs> yeah, aren't you going on the train? Yeah. Then where's your apartment? Where's your apartment? Right? I mean, we overheard that you're buying the apartment, but... Yeah, so... Mm-hmm. Oh my god! make myself bleed no but okay final thoughts on this i love this 10 out of 10 will recommend oh my god like yes even though this gave so much so much <laughs> the l fails even though it wasn't at times you know just two straight guys together but still like you gave the feels and i loved it every single week this cast was so freaking good. I mean, seriously, like, uh, I just, I want a second season so bad. Oh, that felt good. Oh. If this show doesn't get a second season, I swear to God, I need it. Um, I'm like, seriously, the love that I have for just animes that focus on jobs and everything, bruh, I, I need another season of this. That's how I felt with, um, I think it's Wotakoi, when way before it got popular due to COVID and such. So when I watched like season one, all those years ago and such, um, how that show went had a season one and we always got nothing but OVAs and stuff, which I have not still watched because they're really hard to find and it's like that. Um, but still, like with Love is the Hardest for Otaku and all these other shows that have somewhat of a romance, but it's more of an office romance or just like the normal everyday slice of life, but this time not at high school, it's an office setting and such. It's really different and good to see those because I think as a lot of us, where there are people who are kind of really tired of seeing just the normal high school protagonists and the stuff that goes on in high school. And because you are older, you want to see characters do something that is similar to you, which is going to work, doing your normal day at a job, going home, doing some things that you enjoy and love to do, hanging out with friends like normal, going to get drunk if you want to get drunk and stuff like that. So I really love when we get to have a lot of animes focus on an adult character and such. I think those are really good and very wholesome and sweet. Just as much as any other type of slice of life or any anime that has a focus on um, 
a high schooler protagonist. It's very similar how I felt with that one high school series, um, which motioned the thing of puberty and such. And I remember saying like, oh, like I loved it and such and being like, mm, but I kind of wish it was more like adultish and stuff because of course, duh. But but no, at the same time, like, not risking and stuff, but just, you know, going into the thing is like, oh, hey, if someone's an adult and they're still, you know, like a virgin or something like that and just dealing with things of sex and everything. But I will say that series was very much mature with the adult <laughs> maturity and everything else that was happening with it. But this, this was wholesome and cute and everything. And I loved every single minute of it. Everything about it was just top tier would love to watch this again in a heartbeat and such like I said this cast was amazing everybody did a damn good job on it and such but I need that season two <laughs> you cannot just end this show and not give me a second season I love the fact that also with the last episode it was a Christmas theme slash also you know Momo moving out and that I was thinking like I wanted him to live in the same building but the fact is that their neighbors is even better and that the fact is he was super lucky to find something so close to both, you know, Shido and Hakuto. Like, that is just, mm, good. Oh my god, I'm just so happy. But if we do get a second season, like, of course, it's going to be, like, <laughs> everything that we almost saw in season one, except even better. I also love the fact is that, you know, with Shido, he threw away the medicine because of the fact is, of course, um, for stomach pain and stuff, he didn't need it anymore. It signified him growing up especially and or really shown how much he's grown from the beginning of this series to the end where he's like I don't really need this anymore I have moved on from my old boss to my goofy boss and such and I'm just really proud of him I'm proud of everybody in this show everybody did just beautifully with everything of what's happened I, I love Hakuto so much even with his episodes that have focused on him when we first met him and, you know, he ran away from his previous owner into meeting his new owner and such. I thought that was, like, still, that's, I probably think that's my favorite episode. Like, yes, that was truly emotional and such, like, really emotional. And I think if I rewatch that now, I'm just going to cry like a freaking baby. Um, but it was all good in the end. And I will miss this show terribly. And I think, I think, if because I, I just literally restarted my control account. If it is back on, if it is on control, I will definitely put it on my <laughs> rewatch list because it's so freaking good. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards the entirety of my new boss is Goofy. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel and make videos every single day. Enjoy the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all really um, later on today because Merry Christmas. Uh, for the last episode of Forbidden Deductions and then of later on in the week for the final episodes of Pretty Derby, um, JJK Season 2, the next episode of Undead Unluck, and then anything else that comes out when we get to the start of Winter Anime. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye!